Hi, this is the weekly horoscope for Taurus for the week of August. Not August. What happened in August? We're going back to August. Uh oh. For, ooh, really going back to August. So something happened in August for some of you as I'm connecting. And I feel like it's not over. Okay, so for some of you, this could be like dealing with court or something like that. Something happened in August and it's not over. So I feel like that part you're still dealing with for some of you. Show your love and support to your girl Marie by liking, subscribing, and sharing. Also, um, my October monthly horoscopes are up. Pluto just went direct and um, Mercury goes into Libra Monday and also the full moon is happening tonight. So see how it affects you. So on Monday, you can be suspicious of others or someone is playing the waiting game with you and making you wait and you can feel impatient with others this could be a situation where you're trying to listen to what other people are saying to you but at the same time you can't take constructive criticism or you can have tunnel vision at this time and you just want to see things your way with this energy okay I feel also with this energy here um, let me see you may notice that people want to be like you. You can be a trendsetter at this time with this energy. For some of you, people can be copying what you're doing on the social media at this time. So you can find that other people are going to start businesses that are like yours with this energy or they're going to start looking more like you at this time um, as well. Or if you're like a spiritualist, now they're going to become a spiritualist. So it could be things like that. They could be copying your opinion appearance, your style, your fashion sense. Others will tend to lean on you for emotional support and confide in you. Watch for a tendency towards overindulgence. You may lack self-discipline now more than usual. You feel uncomfortable with expressing your emotions and believe that you cannot depend on others for support. You probably feel lonely. Your relationships with women become more intense. You tend to be the subject of emotional control and lack objectivity at this time. You can be more independent and self-reliant by, by these challenges at the end. On Tuesday, your emotions are closer to the surface of your mind. You're more acutely aware of your feelings. It is a time of expressing what you feel. Some of you may not be getting along with the women in your life. Again, I feel also this is a time to focus could be more towards the women in your life and you could be butting heads with them or there could be um, you guys not getting along with this energy as well and rehashing the past with this energy. Those of you who are 50 and over, this is a time where you could be more invested in a group or organization or you could be very much a workaholic at this time and this could be working home, working at the home or I feel also this is you're very open minded to having new experiences, especially those of you who are 50 and over and you're very open to like volunteer work, philanthropy, that kind of thing. Anything to get you out of the house, uh, you're doing it. This could be friends introducing you to new things and new experiences and a new routine coming up for you. For some of you, this is watch your health in regards to nervous disorder and anxieties. Your office or co-workers may be more chaotic and the office environment more hectic. Then on Wednesday, um, Ceres is in the sign of Virgo in your fifth house, which the focus becomes more on nurturing your relationships. For some of you, you're taking on the maternal role. I would be really careful with this. You're either maternal or paternal in your relationship, and I would be really careful with that because you could probably create some kind of codependency between that and then you could find yourself end up doing all the work in the relationship okay some of you may not mind that some of you will okay you tend to want to mother or father your relationships at this time love relationships so be careful because there's no reciprocation being involved and you're then you're going to feel some kind of damn way later on about it okay this could also be a deeper bond and connection with your children that you're creating memories with and spending more time and doing things with them going to festivals and fairs or being more um, invested in their after school activities or just trying to create memories with them um, during this time period. This is a good time to develop your skills or further your education in the healing profession such as counseling, nursing or medicine or in the government field. You have a strength of purpose in your abilities to provide love and care for others and to use sound judgment in your dealings. Business trends are favorable and you may be selected to take 
take on an additional role in your career. Your home life increases in enjoyment and there may be the possibilities of responsibilities being lifted as another person in the family assumes those responsibilities which you can no longer take or this could be a situation where you are a career, you're, you're a um, parent that like um, was taking care of your kids and now your kids are getting a little bit older and now you want to go back to school or you want to go and work now so this could be like um, a mother-in-law or your mother or somebody in the family taking care and watching the kids for you while you go and work or go to school then on Friday let me see Okay, now Thursday, when it comes to relationships, for some of you, this is, you could be walking on eggshells at this time when it comes to getting what you want from other people. So this could be with love relationships and trying to give signals of that you want more from the relationship, or this could be simply flirting with somebody and trying to give signals that you want them, okay? You may also have to make sacrifices for other people at this time, and you don't want to say anything about it because you don't want to start a fight or you don't feel like you should say anything about it and they should do something they should make sacrifices for you and you could be feeling some kind of way about it so you're not so hesitant to speak your mind at this time when it comes to things that you want or request what you want especially at work because you're not trying to rock the boat at this time also at this time you're not so quick to jump into anything new with this energy or you're not so quick to listen to other people and their suggestions for some of you you're trying to keep certain things to yourself at this time you're trying to keep an open schedule so you're not trying to obligate yourself to certain things or people and you're banking on other things to come along at this time Friday you may have a tendency to get in arguments with others now you may have to defend your position you can have a difficult time converting others into your way of thinking or you want them to make certain decisions on their own at this time but at the same time you're slowly or slightly persuading them or pushing them into the direction you want this could be like with your children and their college applications and the college that you want them to go to and you're kind of just like swaying them in that direction or the major that you want them to major them you're kind of like pushing them in that direction that kind of thing you know um this can also be a period of um um a triumph over adversity okay i don't know why i couldn't say that um i feel career ambitions at this time things can start to slow down with this energy and also be a time where you have to deal with some kind of karma through your challenges with other people so this could be you versus um those in authority and not getting along with authority or not getting along with father at this time so pay attention to the challenges that are coming up on friday because this is an opportunity to clear your karma by having a different conversation with other people you could choose not to go through it but then it's going to come out in different avenues in your life okay but if you go through it and you confront the situation but you handle it more in a logical way you'll find that you'll get a different reaction from that person okay sometimes it involves money so I would just pay the money that you owe and not fight it because if you fight it it's going to be more money and then add up the money that was owed and then that was the karmic lesson and you can look it up the first card I come up with is the Fool card. New beginnings are coming up for you this week. You could also be in a bubbly and optimistic mood because of your routine at this time with this energy. You can also be going into hippie mode. The Page of Cups, watch your emotional self. You can have an emotional roller coaster ride as things, wrenches get thrown into your day and plans don't work out exactly as planned. For some of you, you want everything to be perfect because you're a perfectionist. Just try Try to go more with the flow this week because you can have a nervous breakdown at this time with this energy you can take things a little bit too personally for some of you this is taking creative risk at this time you're very much open to new opportunities this could also be a job interview or an audition for some of you for some of you the focus on mother there is new love coming to you and this person could have a really good job um, for some of you the focus on mother at this time and this could be a woman in your life and you two could be butting heads at this time with this energy 
energy or you may have asked this person to do a favor for you and now this person could be backing out on the favor so make sure to get a plan b at this time and c the knight of coins this could be a great time for business picking up but as quickly as money comes in is as quickly as it leaves so be careful with your spending be careful with giving money to other people at this time because you could regret your decision because there could be some unexpected expenditures coming up the ace of wands taking creative risk at this time opening opening yourself up to new experiences and new people coming into your life this week especially those of you who are older the five of wands on the job training is happening this week for you as well with this energy the ten of coins puts an emphasis on money coming in at this time or this could also be money worries with this energy the four of cups i feel like you're more about your financial stability at this time you could be taking your job very seriously at this time you can be taking your business very seriously and you could be annoyed with other people because i feel like other people may not be taking your business or what you're trying to do as seriously as you for some reason so you you may feel like you have to prove yourself to others or other people in your life could be stressing you out at this time because you're dealing with the naysayers in your life so let the haters hate you will prove them wrong you will accomplish things okay so know that so I really wouldn't listen to other people at this time and just do you boo boo okay and just ignore just ignore the rain and the sounds of the rain at this time because that's all they are raining on your parade okay the queen of cups i feel like for some of you this could be dating and there could be opportunities today and if you had like problems dating you could be having like a lot of lessons with love at this time and doing things differently when it comes to love relationships or when it comes to dating at this time for others of you this could be second chances coming up for some of you this could be your old job calling back or if you applied for a job a long time ago they can be calling you back at this time as well the um, eight of coins I feel you could be a perfectionist when it comes to career or you could be throwing yourself into your career like I was saying um, with these energies the ace of swords your perspective and outlook on life can be changing as well for some of you this could be a great time for business picking up this week as well and again you could be throwing yourself into your work the wheel of fortune card the ten of swords the turn of events happening for you as well this could be some self-realization some epiphanies happening certain things that you are obsessed about or worried about those things can change plans can change as well and then you could be feeling a lot more alleviated because everything works itself out okay so this could be an obligation you are trying to get out of or something that there was supposed to be a deadline for and that plan can abruptly end at this time and you guys could be going through something else at this time this could also be retraining happening for some of you as well or going back to school to learn um, some kind of sift system for work at this time as well so you could be getting paid um, to go to school for work I feel like for some of you this could be dealing with a difficult situation and you're ready to throw in the towel but the cards are saying don't give up you know keep trying at this time all right so try and try and try again till you get it right for some of you you can be dealing with bouts of depression because you can be more to yourself at this time so this would be a great time to visit friends to connect with friends and not to stay home alone for some of you this could be starting a new life with this energy and picking up the pieces of your life I feel like you could be very pessimistic because you could be starting from scratch okay and I've been there and I've done that and it sucks okay but you will this too will will pass and it will be short okay for some of you you're finally healing with this energy and you're getting over grief for some of you, you could be journaling about your grief and you can find it to be very healing at this time with this energy for others of you this could be unemployment getting laid off with this energy as well the death card does bring about changes coming up for you the four of wands i feel like for some of you again to focus on family and home with this energy and your traditions the magician card i feel like a lot of prayers are going to be answered so again don't give up hope about certain situations even when it looks hopeless try to keep the energy positive 
um, during this time period. You know, there's a power, we're still in high holidays, it's a period of Sukkot. So, you know, try to keep that energy positive in regards to what you want because the universe is listening for you. And then the Ace of Swords with the Magician card, something that you want is really coming to fruition, okay? You are a perfectionist with your career. You could be throwing yourself back into your career, recommitting to your goals this week with this energy as well. I feel for some of you, this could be you standing out from the crowd at work with this energy and people or those in authority are, are noticing you. This is a great time for my artists, success, successful time for you with art, with this energy. So mazel. For some of you, this could be buying or selling a home or doing property renovations on your home. I feel like certain things in your life can be a bit of a process. So this could be dealing with court or certain things that you want at this time can be a process as well so you may have to wait this could also be traveling coming up have faith that everything is going to work itself out i feel like you can be crushing on somebody or you're not over somebody because i see a naughty boy or a naughty girl around you the six of cups you can be sentimental about the past with this energy as well the nine of wands you can be dealing with your fears and sitting on your hands about things that you want to do at this time because of your worries and concerns that things won't turn out the way that you expect them to and that you're worried about them at this time for others of you this is fear of rejection with this energy that you could be dealing with fear of speaking up fear of you know just tolerating certain situations because you don't want to be yelled at and stuff this could also be a time period with the nine of nine of wands and the death card resisting change at this time as well in you not being open to change and kind of fighting the changes that are coming up so be careful with that for others of you this is like a reality check that's going to be coming up because maybe you were sheltered as a child at this time and you know and going into the big city and being in college and stuff like that so you know you may be learning from the school of hard knocks at this time with this energy so again be careful with that energy this week as well i feel like for some of you be careful with dealing with manipulative people or somebody really pushing their agenda on you i feel that others could be forcing you out of your comfort zone the four of swords i feel like you're more about your stability and you're more about your security you're more about your routine you're not about trying anything new for some of you the page of coins there's another money opportunity coming in for you or this could be business picking up at this time the six of coins I feel with this energy here that you know you can be a little bit gullible so be careful with this energy you're very helpful to certain people in your life at this time the Emperor card you're more about your stability at this time and you're more about your money situation i feel like you can be dealing with somebody that's very stubborn and stuck in their ways of thinking you can be dealing with father or father side of the family this week the hangman card indecisions are coming up i feel like you need a lot of convincing or somebody around you needs a lot of convincing the two of swords i feel like somebody could be crushing on you at this time but afraid afraid to come forward and talk to you I love you, my bulls, and have a fabulous week. Kisses. Mm.